Fuzzy Bird, welcome back to Mario Kart Wii. Today, we are getting started with 100cc with, of course, another new character. Really looking forward to this one because we're picking up the speed a little bit, the track should go by faster, things will be more difficult, but it'll also be a whole lot more exciting. We're gonna be doing, right over here, 100cc. This one is really interesting because with 50, it was carts only. 100 is bikes only. We can switch it now that we've completed 50cc to carts, from carts to carts and bikes. But I don't see the need to do that. We can go to bikes only here for 100. I think it's the only Mario Kart game to do that, to lock a certain difficulty to a certain type of, of like, you know, cart. It's really interesting. But for right now, we're gonna be playing as the Big Bad Wario. And he's ready for it too. So we have a choice of three bikes here with the standard bike L, Flame Runner, and Wario Bike. I gotta try the Wario Bike at some point, but for right now, I think we're just gonna do standard bike L. Wario's ready, I'm ready. The bikes do work a little bit different than carts do. It's a very distinct thing here in Mario Kart. We will be showcasing, of course, that in a moment. But for right now, we gotta get started with the Mushroom Cup, which, of course, as per usual, has Luigi Circuit, Moo Moo Meadows, Mushroom Gorge, and Toad's Factory. Let's get started. So we're back to Luigi Circuit. Unlike in the credits, it's also the Luigi statue, not a statue of my me. Okay. So. Let's see how this goes. Wario in the back with the bike, but everybody else has one. So the thing about the bikes is that you can wheelie with them, which is really cool. You can sort of just go in a straight line with that. And when you wheelie, you press up on the directional buttons and you can just go super duper fast. They can put a bob on behind us and explode a bunch of people. The only caveat, the only downside to being able to wheelie constantly and get a speed boost like this is that we can't do a red drift. We can only go up to blue. So it does sort of change our gameplay approach in some ways, but to be honest with you, depending on the bike, I sometimes prefer the bikes a little bit more, especially for tracks like this that do have a lot of straightaways. It can be pretty nice to just be able to uh, do this, get a speed boost, and really make the most out of it. And like I said before, we're at 100cc instead of 50, so we're able to, oh no, get blasted by a pow block but also we're able to move a little bit faster. So the races should go by pretty quickly comparative to uh, before, but we just want to keep wheeling wherever we can, just like that, and start drifting through all this. As soon as we get that blue drift, we want to let it go. Whenever convenient, I suppose. We're heading into the last lap already. Here we go. And we can still drift through the turns and stuff like that. Got it. I got a little question block that I would like to put down right there. But managing all that can be pretty challenging. Just like drifting, wheeling. But once you get the hang of it, it's a really cool setup. Now certain bikes I'm not a big fan of. It really depends. And we'll get more into that as we try different ones. But, oh no! Oh, I get nailed pretty good by the, the blue shell. But luckily we were on a speed booster so we just get right back into the race and finish our first round with Wario. All right, Wario's pretty happy about it. We win our first race here in 100cc. Also our first race with the bike. Things are turning out pretty well. So that means we can head to the next race. And the action is keeping up here at Moo Moo Meadows. The cows are ready to spectate the motorcycle race of a lifetime. Let's go for it. I love how there's always the happy cow on the Mario Kart banner up there at the finish line. So cute. So I'll do the same thing. I'll do this and wheelie. I think that does give us a bigger speed boost too. It's really cool. And I'm not really sure. I don't think the bikes work like this in any other Mario Kart game. I think when Mario Kart 8 swings around, um, the bikes don't wheelie like this anymore. So it's definitely a different vibe for this game than it is any of the others in that way. Okay, do a trick like that. We can still do tricks with the bike, which is pretty nice. I'll put the banana right there, I'll hold the green shell out, do another trick, awesome. And I think this is the first time we're racing as a heavyweight character. Mario, Luigi, and Peach were all, and Yoshi, were all medium weights, if I'm not mistaken. So we had all the same cart choices for that one. This is a big turn, so I definitely want to just get through there. We're already in lap two out of three, though. Got it, whoa, whoa. That was pretty good, 
Put a couple of bananas down and oh no. <laughs> Not much I can do about that. But if I break and then wheelie, I think that sometimes that can give me a speed boost. I'm not exactly sure how that mechanic works, but there are ways to sort of get like a, a really good strong start that way. Okay, hold this banana out. Start drifting again. The characters that we're racing against are definitely going to be a lot more determined to catch up to us too. It's not only that the carts are going faster at 100cc, it's that the computers themselves are better at playing the game. It's a whole mixture of difficulty. I cannot believe I was able to dodge a cows there. I'm gonna try to cut in. Yep, really close there. Really good drifting going on. Uh oh, oh, I was hoping I could be in the air when that happened. It was a little too late to it. That's okay. Everybody else got knocked out by two, so we're fine. Wheelie all the way to this boost pad like that. Got it? Banana there. And we're almost there. Boom, another track completed. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wario might be the world's first sore winner. <laughs> Even when he wins, he's still mean. Telling people to <laughs> that they're losers to eat this. That's not very nice. Let's go to the next race. So we got 30 points in total. Let's see what we can do in the next one. All right, Mushroom Gorge is looking pretty cool. And because we took some of the crazier shortcuts on this before, I'm not really too worried about doing that this time. At this rate, we're just focused on the fastest way through each time. All right, revving it up. We get the wheelie, we're good to go. It's so satisfying to do that. This is really one of the few games in the Mario Kart series where I actually will prefer to ride the bikes at times. Usually I avoid them at all costs, but not the case here. And I think in Mario Kart 7, were there even bikes at all? I don't think there were. So yeah, bikes have sort of like this weird history in Mario Kart because they were first introduced in this game, which I guess is technically what, the sixth Mario Kart? Uh oh, whoa, just trying to make sure I don't fall off there. Oh man, we still might. Come on, Mario, no! <laughs> Not good. All right, speed up again. Got it, got it, got it. And then we're bouncing over here. We gotta catch up again. Watch out for the Goomba. Got it. Remember that we can only really get the blue boost there, so. As soon as I get that, I just wanna let go and keep moving. We're way back in seventh now. That is definitely tough. But I can do this. I get triple mushroom, but unfortunately the banana, which didn't slow me down very much, so we're fine. I'll go over here. Whoa. Do that. Bounce again. And then as soon as I can, we're in second place. I think I wanna hold on to this mushroom. Definitely go this route. It's way safer. I have a specific shortcut in mind with this. I just don't know if it's actually there. I know it's in Mario Kart 8 when this, this track was added to the booster course pass, but is it over here? I'm gonna find out. I think there might be a bouncing mushroom right here. There is! Oh man, oh man, that was so cool. Awesome little corner cut there for sure. In front of Luigi and all the other racers. I need to push through this. Got it, got it. Nice. Come on, we get a banana right there. I'm gonna hold this out. And we are just going to boost through all of this. Really through that stuff. We're building up that lead more and more. Definitely sticking to the right side here was the better bet. And then watch out for the Goomba that I can barely even see. Got it. So I'll put these bananas down. And we will finish off race number three, I think, with Wario. Wario's really pleased about it. I'm glad to see that. Let's go for one more race in this cup so that we can get that big golden trophy for Wario. Wario loves anything that's covered in gold. And it's gonna be, of course, the 100cc Mushroom Cup finale race. It is Toad's Factory. We struggled with this one a little bit in the 50cc race. Competition was keeping up with us here and there. Lots of crazy items, for sure. So I really wanna zoom through it this time. Whoa, too soon, way too soon. Okay, well, when I tried to fix it, I sort of messed it up a little bit more, but that's okay. We'll zoom through, 
and we'll just try to get a good win here. Oh, can I get through this without getting squished? Yes, I can. That plus the wheelie is really fast. Okay, get through this. I still have yet to get an item. There we go, that fixes it. And I get a Koopa shell. Not too bad. So yeah, now that we've sort of gotten introduced to the bikes, I would love to hear what are your thoughts on how the bikes work in Mario Kart Wii? Are you a fan of the wheeling mechanic and do you sort of still wish it was you know, like this in some of the future Mario Kart games? I would love to hear your thoughts on it. I think it's pretty cool, but also, you know what? The fact that it's a little bit different in this game, I think it makes it stand out even more, so that's cool. All right, we are going to drift through this, just like that. Wario being mean as per usual. Nothing too surprising there, I suppose. Just gonna try to get through this without hitting any of these crates. Oh, unfortunately, I hit the very last one. Just keep wheeling. They're trying to catch up to me, but I don't think they can. Because we just do that. I drift through the sink. Ooh. Got it. Got it, okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, I almost made it. If I could have gone through, that would have been huge. Oh uh, no, and I held my banana out at the wrong time. Oh my gosh. We could have just gotten such a lead by dodging that power block, but not quite in the cards this time. We still have a huge lead here. As we head into the last lap, this is pretty good. Just gonna get that and that. Now I definitely wanna boost through this, hold the banana out, and get back to drifting. Nice. Go, go, go. Whoa, watch out for the crates. I hit one again. The faster we move through that stuff, I guess the harder it is to dodge. Oh, there's a mushroom for free. Very nice. Oh no, whoa, what was that? Come on, grab another mushroom and really try to move it through here. Big trick there, but not into the mud. Oh no, oh no. What well, can you tricks off those? That was good. Good to know. Oh no, get this boost right there. This one as well. One last jump. <laughs> Definitely sort of a messy last lap, but we get the win anyways. Wario does win. 60 points to Wario. All right, so with that done, let's go ahead and enjoy our little victory. All right, so yeah, just because we changed difficulty doesn't mean that this changes too much, unfortunately. It's the same thing as before, but this time it was Luigi and Bowser who tried to keep up with us, but honestly, this went by so quick. We were able to destroy the competition quite well. You can see that there's sparks popping up from the side of their bikes. That's a different kind of drifting that I'll definitely be explaining when we run into it, but for right now, guess who won? He's gonna let everybody know that he won. It's Wario. He's jabbing, he's, he's moving. Interesting, but we get the golden trophy here for Mushroom Cup 100cc, and we get two stars. That's pretty solid for some of the mistakes I made there. Pretty happy with that one. And we don't get anything special for getting it fully completed, but that doesn't matter because we're hopping straight back into the action. We still have one more cup left to complete today, so let's just get back to it. We'll go to the Grand Prix, we'll go to 50, or oh no, 100cc with the bikes only, and do our next one with Wario. We'll change our bike up a little bit though. Instead of the standard bike L, we have a choice between Flame Runner and Wario bike. And we're playing as Wario. I got a race with the Wario bike. Stats wise, this one is a lot lot more, um, I guess, focused on like acceleration, it seems like. A lot worse drift, a lot better off-road and mini turbo though. So yeah, let's give this one a try. You definitely are, you got the, the hot rod motorcycle here. It's very, very cool. Let's try the Flower Cup, which has Mario Circuit, Coconut Mall, DK Summit, and Wario's Goldmine. Okay, our next race is Mario Circuit here for the Flower Cup. I love this track so much, so I don't mind. I know this one gets really hectic with the items. And with the bikes, <laughs> we'll have to wait and see. This is of course not the dirt bike, the standard bike we had before. This is this big wheeled hot rod. And with this, I think it, oh no, I did it too soon. That's not so good. We're gonna have to catch up big time now. Watch out DK, I got places to be. And with this one, oh no, this one has pretty normal drifting. We get the superstar here. 
but some of them will have, so I don't know if we'll run into it here, some of them will have what's called, I think, inside drifting, where they sort of hit the floor and you'll see all those sparks be created. And basically with that, you have to be careful because it'll cut the drift in really quickly. And that can be difficult to work with sometimes. So you just have to know how to drift with those ones a little bit more. I'm not as big of a fan of those, but we're just gonna try to keep ahead of the competition now that we've stolen the lead back. Oh my, oh my, somebody's coming with a thundercloud. Okay, they're not gonna get me. I don't know if we've run into the thundercloud yet, but I'll talk about it if we do. All right, come on, come on. Get through this. Now I gotta be careful here because I'm gonna get pow blocked, but we immediately just start wheeling again to pick up speed. Avoid the chain chop if possible. So with a heavier bike like this, I think it really takes some time to really get at max speed, but once we do, we're really barreling forward. So it's our goal to sort of build that momentum and then keep it for as long as possible. That's what's gonna enable us to get a super huge lead with a bike like this. I'm just gonna keep wheeling. All right, Wario having the time of his life. Oh, I can't quite get the mushroom over there. I didn't see it in time. Okay, let's go ahead and get, boom, that one. Nice, nice. Watch out for the chain chomp again. And I'm just gonna wheelie through this one. All right. Gotta go like that. And one more drift should do the trick. Awesome, we'll throw out all of our items for good measure, but it looks like Wario is gonna get the win with his first race on the chopper. He's really having a great time. Because we see Wario ride this bike around in like all the WarioWare games and stuff like that, as well as um, as like a special move in Smash Bros. So it's cool to see it go full circle and as like a drivable bike here in Mario Kart Wii. But next up, I guess we're riding this thing indoors. We're at Coconut Mall. Coco Burger. Interesting, they're selling all sorts of food in there. I'm ready to get started. Let's win another one. Let's not overdo it though. I think that should be good. Yeah, there we go. Much better. <laughs> I'm going to do a little trick off the side of that. That was really nice too. Do another one right there and then land in a drift. Boom, go to a wheelie. And then definitely, okay, I did not do a trick there. I think I messed it up. Baby Mario really trying to keep up with me then but I'm gonna hit you with the banana. There we go. I can't do a trick off of that, but I can do a trick off this. Nice. Drift through this part of the staircase. Whoa, oh, I hit the corner there. That's not so good. I'm going to, oh no. I can't do a trick off that part either? Interesting. Unless I just did it wrong, but I don't think I did. We gotta watch out for the cars coming in this way. Just gonna wheelie past that spot and then, oh, perfect timing. Not a bad first lap. Could have been better in some spots, but overall, I'll take it. I'll put a banana right there, do a trick here, and keep it moving. I think it's still good to yeah, stay over here. Oh, I hit the wall. That's not so good. That's slowing me down a lot. Gonna boost through this part, do a trick there, and then, oh no, this is not good. I'm going off the wrong side of the escalator. Oh no! That slowed me down a ton. Baby Mario takes a bit of a lead around this corner, but I guess that might be a bit of an equalizer. Baby Mario uh, also got hit by that pal block, I hope. I don't know how I hit it at that angle. Come on, Baby Mario, get back here. I gotta be careful. They could absolutely catch up or, or keep up in front of us. Uh oh, I hear that <laughs> electric cloud again. Okay, we're catching up to you now. Ooh, you know what? We'll see if you get hit by anything here as you're trying to avoid the cars. It looks like you won't, but I will still take the lead. I have this red shell, it has your name on it, baby Mario, if you try to pass me. So just keep that in mind. Whoa, see if I could have done that before, I wouldn't have lost so much time to the escalator. Going through here, getting this boost. I gotta stay to the left side, please, please, please. There we go. Oh, that was a little weird, but we make our way through. Got it. Uh-oh, no, I should be fine. I should be fine. Not even worried about it. I pulled the bananas now. And we drift through, drift through again. I think I wanna stay on 
This side if possible, come on. That's not so good. Ooh, this is so intense. Do a trick there. I'm just gonna avoid all that. To the left, there's a ton of items over there. Oh my. Ooh, oh, couldn't quite get it. Maybe not my best slap here for the last one, but that is okay. Because Wario still wins, he wants everybody to know. So with that done, 30 points, we're halfway through this cup. Let's go to the next one. DK Summit is our third race here. <laughs> all right. So let's see how all terrain this motorcycle really is. We've been racing it on like normal paved roads up until now we raced it through a shopping mall. But now we're taking it to the slopes. <laughs> Watch out snowboarders and skiers, there's a motorcycle on the course. All right. Drift through this pretty well, not taking any of the crazy half pipe stuff. Sometimes you really just don't need to. Throw that banana out there. Got it. Gotta keep moving. Nice. That red shell is really trying to get me. What did I do there? How did I land on top of it? <laughs> that was silly. All right, well. It found a way to get me in the end. Oh my gosh, calm down, calm down. Everybody trying to knock me off the course here. All right, go up here like this. Oh no, watch it, watch it, watch it. Gonna drift like that. And then baby Mario in front of us again, trying to hit you with the green shell. Couldn't quite make it work, but the blue shell is gonna knock you out. Finally, we see the blue shell hit somebody that's not me. That makes me feel better. God, I I'm not all alone with that one. I'll put a banana down and then get the triples out here for the extra protection. We got the red shell right there. Not even gonna hit me. Last time it just waited for me and immediately nailed me. This time it gets distracted, gets hit by something else. Whatever. Ooh, look at all these mushrooms. Thank you. Ooh, no, wait, wait. I was gonna say that mushroom almost turned into a bad thing. And then I will try sort of a different path this time. If we go up this way, we can get a couple of items. I guess we didn't really even need them, but I feel like that's technically a little bit faster to go that way. Okay, I'm going to wheelie through this section. We're going into the last lap. I drift right here. And boom, going all the way to the top of the slope again. Who needs a ski lift when you have a cannon? Come on, Wario. A little bit more to go. I feel like I never take this way, which I sort of see why I never take that way. <laughs> I mean, I guess if I didn't hit the wall there, it wouldn't have been so bad. And I will try to, whoa, boost through here. It's not going so well. How are we going that way? I don't know. We have such a huge lead though, so as long as I don't get too silly here, I think we'll win. I think we'll be fine. <laughs> There we go, gonna wheelie through this part and then do the same thing I did before because I really think it was better. Yep. And got it. Let's get a couple bananas right there and boom, we win. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> he was too busy celebrating to get smacked by the red shell. That was so silly. All right, so we have one more race left to do today as Wario here. Let's see if we can make it yet another win. So it's a very fitting one, Wario's gold mine. Let's see if we can't get the win on the home turf. Wario has one thing on his mind and it's just gold. Golden trophies, golden mines, golden motorcycles. It's all he wants. Let's give it to him. Gotta win this last race. I think we can handle it. So far we're undefeated at 100 CC. And that's pretty cool. If we, whoa, watch out for all that stuff. I'll go up here for an item. I think it'll be fine. Whoa, I almost went off the side. Ah! <laughs> really threading the needle with that one. Watch out for the bats. Oh man. Let's go down this way a little bit. 
Keep drifting. Okay, DK. Watch it. <laughs> Not what I wanted. We'll just keep moving. Oh my, oh my. And then I will, oh no, get hit by just about everything here. I won't take the shortcut, we're not at a good angle for it. And, and out of there. Oh no, oh no, ready? Drift through this part, get that. And, let's go this way. Can I get the speed boost? Mario, you get back here. I guess he didn't get shrunk down. There we go, oh, he hit something. I don't know what he hit, but he definitely hit something. I want to do this, get more items. Constantly making, ow, good use of the items, I hope. They are really giving me a hard time with this race. They do not want me to win. Oh, the blue shell. Oh, no, 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 okay. That was so close. Come on, Wario, come on. We can't let these guys beat us on your own home track. That's just too embarrassing. Out of the way, please. Oh man. Come on, come on. Ow, no. Okay, I, I thought I was gonna fall off. Everything is happening here to try to stop me from winning. All right, boom. Getting a big corner cut there. And this is the last lap. Whatever I can do to earn up a lead. Got it? Got it. Drifting through here. Nice. Oh no, oh no, I got hit by the bat. <laughs> That's okay, we have a really good lead right now. So as long as disaster doesn't strike over and over again, I think we'll be okay. Keep the wheelie going. That's always the number one thing to keep in mind when we're riding the bikes. Oh man, bananas. It's not bananas, that's not what we need to keep in mind. It's just wheeling over and over. I think I'll take the shortcut again. Ooh. Got it. Big trick there, and with it, boom, we win yet another race. Eight races, all won in a row today. That's amazing, and Wario, he knows it. <laughs> Let's go ahead and check out the trophy victory for these for this last cut. So a lot of hard fought racing there. Definitely a bike I'm not super used to. These heavier vehicles and just heavier weight characters in general. Not my specialty. I like lighter weight characters that can zip around real fast, even if that comes at like other downsides. But hey, we did really good with Wario, so I'll take it. And Wario seems to know that. He looks really pleased by it. We beat out baby Mario and baby Daisy. I guess it's like taking trophies from a baby instead of candy. Is that the saying we're using? I guess so. Doesn't matter who the competition is, Wario just loves to win. So we got first place there. We get the, uh, the flower and we get another two star. I thought that one was gonna be one star for sure, but I guess not. So with two different cups completed, we won trophies in the 100cc mushroom and flower cups. We, of course, can now play the 100cc star cup. Very nice. And there we go. So that was our first two cups here in 100cc. We have plenty more, uh, I guess, high action moments in this cup series with um, all the motorcycles and stuff. We'll have to see all that goes in the next episode of Mario Kart Wii. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.